Coral. Coral. I'm lost, Carl. I just wanted us to live in peace, but everything I touch just turns to dust. Inflicted. I'm lost. The world's falling apart around me, and I'm trying to do the right thing. And I can't find any answers. What should I do, Carl? They're killing us. I don't want to answer violence with violence, but what choice do I have? Emotional. I miss you, Carl. I miss you so much. And then I see his son. That's right. Feel your fucking remorse, you stupid bitch. I could have killed you then and here. That was the son of Carl. Carl was Carl was the old guy that was the artist that basically was our master. And he was like super dope, he was super nice. He was the artist. And then uh his junkie son tried to get money from him and then he he was trying to steal and then yeah, you know, all that shit happened and then he died because of a heart attack or something. That was his son, yeah. Carl died. Yeah, Carl died. He died. That's what set him off. That's why that's why Marcus initially quote unquote died. He fucking told the cop to uh, shoot Marcus. He was like, Marcus, he killed my father. Talk to your people. How many of us survived the attack? A few hundred. That's good. Maybe more if you count those hiding all over the city. If you hadn't triggered the bomb, we'd all be dead. They say they don't want to take any risks with deviants. So they're rounding our people up and taking them to the camps for extermination. In a few hours, we're going to be the only ones left. Wound. What's your system status? I'm okay. The bullet didn't hit any bike components. You could have been killed trying to save me, Marcus. You have to think of our people first. Nothing else matters. In a few hours, it'll all be over. We'll have changed the world, or the world will have destroyed us. You have to make a choice, Marcus. But whatever you choose, we will follow you. I love you, Marcus. Damn! Did you get... Are you computed to say that? Is that in your computation? Mm-hmm. You lying to me, bitch? He's like, all right. You telling the truth? <laughs> I scanned you. I scanned you. I scanned your fucking cyberware and hardware, motherfucker. Your software. You ain't lying. They just did it. They weren't. They. They not about to do it. They just did it, real quick, little quickie. You couldn't see it. It was robot style. That's what happened. Handshake. You know what I'm saying? That's robot sex. You got a little handshake going on. I thought you'd be safe staying with us. I was wrong. You need to leave the city while you still can. Getting Alice away from here is all that matters now. Gigabyte E. We have to catch the last bus. We might still have a chance to cross the border. Marcus. Marcus. 
Save our people. Decide Connor's fate? Bro, Connor is a G. What the fuck do you mean? He's staying with us. The fuck? Was he the one that called it? That called the, the bomb? Or the... The squad? If it weren't for you, I'd be dead. Thanks to you, I might see our people free one day. You and I haven't always agreed, but I know that we're fighting for the same thing. Whatever you decide, I'm with you, Marcus. Let's go, Josh. Now, where's uh, Simon? Simon's still alive, right? Where's Simon? Simon! There he is. We'll get to you in a second, Connor. Mm -hmm. Our people are counting on you, Marcus. You're the only one who can lead us. Wherever you need to go, we'll follow you. Who the fuck is that guy? <laughs> That's Simon. Simon. Who the fuck is that guy? Check on the squad. You feel me? The real squadron. With you, Connor, you got a little chat. It's my fault. The humans managed to locate Jericho. I was stupid. I should have guessed they were using me. I'm sorry, Marcus. I can understand if you decide not to trust me. Oh no, we trust in you, boy. You're one of us now. Your place is with your people. There are thousands of androids at the Cyberlife assembly plant. If we could wake them up, they might join us and shift the balance of power. Oh shit, we're in there. You want to infiltrate the Cyberlife tower? Connor, that's suicide. They trust me. They'll let me in. If anyone has a chance of infiltrating Cyberlife, it's me. If you go there, they will kill you. There's a high probability. But statistically speaking, there's always a chance for unlikely events to take place. Let's fucking go, Connor. Be careful. Oh shit, we about to pull off a fucking heist. Inform your people of your choice. How do we do that? Where we go? Oh, I gotta go up here? Oh shit, sorry, I gotta take the podium. <clears throat> Is this thing on? Hello? <laughs> Humans have decided to exterminate us. Our people are packed in camps right now, being destroyed. Time has come to make a choice. One that very well may determine the future of our people. Oh shit, the public opinion is indifferent at the moment. Damn.
Yeah. I'm thinking of a demonstration because if I can ace Connor's side, right? If cuz cuz I feel like what's going to happen is I'm going to rock with with Connor for like half of the mission and I'm going to have to get people. If I can get enough people, they're going to get scared cuz they're thinking that we're super small at the moment, right? So that could be the wild card that that pushes it into crazy yeah, we're, we're going A, 100%. I know. I know you're all angry. And I know you want to fight back. But I assure you, violence is not the answer here. We are going to tell them, peacefully, that we want justice. And if there's any humanity in them, they will listen. And if not, others will take our place and continue this fight. That's right. You see? Exactly. Are you ready to follow me? Hurrah! It's okay, North. You're still my lover. I love you. I mean, we kept everyone alive so far. You know what I'm saying? 